It's a sunny day in New York City, and I'm James Sweeney with your AM Anticipation Report. U.S. stock index futures, they signaled for a higher open on Wednesday, this ahead of several key economic indicators that could give an idea on Friday's non-farm payrolls number. Most notably, the ADP employment report for November has just been published. Economists did expect 170,000 private sector jobs to be created during the month, a rise from the 130,000 created in October, and the numbers just released showed a rise by 173,000. Also relevant is the non-manufacturing ISM index, which does track economic activity in the services sector. Analysts do forecast the index to read 55.1 for November, narrowly down from October's 55.4 reading. Other data on Wednesday's docket does include international trade data, new home sales figures for both September and October, and the Federal Reserve's beige book in the afternoon. The day will be a quiet one for U.S. earnings, however, with just a few companies reporting third quarter numbers before the opening bell. And bank stocks will be worth watching on Wednesday, this after the Europe European Commission imposed a 1.71 billion euro fine on some of the world's largest banks for interest rate manipulation by its traders. The banks to be fined include Citibook, Citigroup, Deutsche Bank, Royal Bank of Scotland, JP Morgan, and Societe Generale. And lastly, overseas China Shanghai Composite rising to its highest level since mid September on news that financial liberalization reforms in the Shanghai Free Trade Zone would be implemented within three months.